Hi, everyone, and welcome back to JSA TV and JSA Podcast, where we're coming to you live from the floor of PTC 2024. I'm Barb Mitchell from JSA. Joining me today is Scott Despot, a business development and sales of Spencer Building Carrier Hotel right. from Vancouver, BC. It's so great to see you. Thank you very much for having me. Yeah, it's so it's I believe this is is it your first PTC? It is my first, yes. Yeah. Yeah, I've known about the conference forever, right. but uh, first time attending and yeah, very impressed. It's uh, good networking opportunities. It's been very productive so far. Yeah, it's it is an amazing yeah. event and amazing I mean being that it's in January, it kind of sets the stage for the year. Right. Flew out of Vancouver. Wasn't sure if we were going to get out in the snow. So it's right. uh, it's nice to be here in this uh, in the weather for sure. Yeah, we have that in common. Yes, <laughs> Left yes. a little snow behind in yes. Vancouver. But um, yeah. And so it's, you know, been as we kick off the new year, I think you have some some um, updates that you can share, namely a, a new meet me room. You can tell us about. Yeah. Tell us a little bit about yeah, that. Sure. So. Spencer Building and Harbor Center in Vancouver has been in business for about 25 years. Yeah. Um, we came to the realization that even though we're very recognized in the marketplace, we needed to maintain relevancy in the market. And so to do yeah. that, um, we wanted to, we needed to, we felt, build out a new meet me room and a 200 kilowatt uh, co-location room in the Spencer building, which is adjacent to Harbor Center. Yeah. Um, and combine that just with the, you know, the pent up demand in, Vancouver, Western Canada, Canada for space and power and data centers. Yeah. Uh, it was just the the right decision to make to to build out that facility. Yeah, and I mean, I think again, we I mentioned we're both from Vancouver. I'm yep. familiar, of course, with right. um, Spencer Building, but Harbor Center, Harbor Center being the the private connectivity hub for Western Canada, and, and yeah. so it's there's a long legacy that exists behind that. Can yes. you talk about that, just the evolution from building on that legacy to where you're going now? Yeah, you know, we've been doing this for about 25 years, so we definitely yeah. have built up that legacy. And, and the, the name, it always surprises me that it's as recognizable, not just within Canada, but internationally as a connectivity hub of Vancouver. So yeah. um, that legacy is something that, you know, what we're, how we're building on that is really putting the new facility together, piggybacking on that um, that reputation and knowledge in the marketplace, yeah. and putting together the new facility has been, I think, um, you know, the it, it'll be a big step forward for the organization. Yeah, and you know, you you talk we we're talking about being the connectivity hub, but of course, Vancouver is known as a gateway city to both to the U.S., but yeah. also APAC. And so knowing that there's that local market to serve as well yeah. as the international, how is Spencer Building positioned to help with yeah. that? Yeah, I mean, Vancouver, as you know, is a very international city. It is a gateway to APAC, the APAC region. Um, as far as international businesses coming to Vancouver, one of the advantages of Harbor Center in Vancouver is we are able to connect businesses to long-haul fiber routes going east into Canada and mm -hmm. south down to the United States. Um, there's also the advantage of companies who are building out their services and are looking for new markets. They come into Vancouver, they're looking for an uh, edge data center um, location, and that's really ideal. That's an ideal fit for Harbor Center yeah. uh, in Vancouver. Yeah. Scott, it's these. I feel like these interviews are so quick, and we're just we're just <laughs> trying to scratch the surface here. We, I mean, I mean, I could sit and chat with you for quite a long time, and I think that some of our viewers will likely want to connect yeah. with you and your team and and learn more about what's happening in Vancouver, what's happening with Spencer Building. How can they connect with you? Uh, through our website, spencerbuilding.com, or directly. Um, uh, um, Scott dot, Scott at spencerbuilding.com for email and just reach out directly and love to have a conversation. Yeah, perfect. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for having We're gonna, me. This is going to be the first of many. We're going to. <laughs> we'll talk I to hope you so. again and again. And uh, and we appreciate your time. I know you perfect. know it's it's a busy show, so we appreciate you taking the time to come chat with us. Thank you. Yeah, and thank you viewers for tuning in today to JSA TV and JSA podcasts. Happy networking.